I'll be honest, I've just had a breakup, so it's good to get anywhere uh, than living with your ex-boyfriend, isn't it? <laughs> and do you know what's worse about breakups is when you break up with someone, I don't know if you've noticed, but you get stuck with the worst of your friendship circle to be your spirit guide back. <laughs> it's always the Mrs Havisham of your group, isn't it? <laughs> the one at two in the morning after three bottles of wine will tell you why you're unlovable. <laughs> and now they don't even do that in person. They just whack you on Tinder and let everybody else do it. <laughs> it's awful, Tinder. Welcome back. You can now pick a partner the way you pick a pizza topping. <laughs> My friends have me on all of them. MySingleFish.com. I was on every single one, right? My friends even sent me traffic light dating. You have to go as a traffic light colour, right? As if speed dating's not demoralising enough, right? <laughs> now, if you go as red, you're not available. What kind of an arsehole? <laughs> to a singles night <laughs> and says without speaking, I'm loved, I'm sorry about you. <laughs> right, if you go as amber, you're intelligent, you're smart, right? If you go as green, you're up for it. You're ready to move on. Don't go as green. <laughs> Cos you'll end up at the bar alone whilst all the ambers have a fucking great time. <laughs> After that, I said, I'm not doing dating like this anymore. This modern dating, I'm not doing it. I'm just going to do things the old-fashioned way. Just get hammered with somebody you don't fancy, sleep with them anyway, and then let them slowly grow anew over time. 